Get on the train Before it leaves the station The truth train is coming Gonna run them down Run them down Alright, here you go. Hey folks, we're here today doing a little video Just to kind of show the the transparency of the Mammothon uh, donations here Just so you guys can see pretty clearly here That the donations that were made The money is getting put onto Stephen and Brendan's canteens Uh at an understandably slow rate but I show the email here in the video so you guys can understand from the company where you do this where you put the money on the books where it explains that you have to do it every seven days which is actually every eight days because they don't actually start the seven days until the day after you donate and so it effectively becomes eight days and that sort of stuff so anyway that's 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 where this is at but now we're at the point where you'll see it by the end of this counting up counting it along as we go or counting as we go along there that we're at uh, $2,100, basically, uh, at this point in time. All right, so without further ado, just so, you know, anybody that was wondering or, you know, wanted to be sure, here's the receipts that show the money going on to Stephen and Brendan's canteens. All righty, hello there today, folks. How you doing? We're here today going, just doing a, another one of the transparency videos for the Mammothon donations, just so... Just so that everybody can see, there's no question that the money is getting where it's supposed to go. Not because of any particular reason other than just for people to be able to be reassured that their donations got to the place they're supposed to go. So, that's all it is. No no uh, big deal. Uh, so, we'll go ahead and show what's been going on. Last time, I believe I showed you guys basically May 4th through May 21st for Brendan and Stephen. Uh, it looks like there is now on May 30th. Uh, and uh, June 9th, June 18th, and June 26th now. So, anyways, we'll go through, and then the same thing for Steven. So, we'll go through where, you know, so basically, let's, let's, it started with, we did the, we did um, Mammothon at the end of April, uh, at the very end of April, basically. So, the, after we got all the stuff sorted out, the first, um, payments into the into the canteens was on May 4th this little thing over here explains how they can only make a deposit off uh, with with one card you can only do a deposit every seven days and the way that they count it they don't start the seven days until the day after you make a donation or after a day after you make a deposit so it's actually eight days they have to wait so that's what this little thing right here is explaining here let me just uh, there is a $300 deposit limit with a single card over a seven-day period to deposit a greater amount within that time you need a different card. Well, she, Tracy, is using two cards. She uses 300 to put on Brendan's, 300 to put on Stevens, and she does that pretty much every eight to nine days, as you'll see here. So, just wanted to show everybody that. That's why, that's why it has to be done this way, uh, just in case anybody was wondering. All right. So, as I said, we'll start with Brendan here, May 4th. Okay. You can see here, here it is, the $300, there's a receipt number here. You'll see that this number is completely unique from every other receipt number you're going to see for Brendan. That means that there are different receipts. This isn't just a copy of one receipt over and over again, just in case anybody's, you know, anybody thought something like that. So just keep in mind, these these receipt numbers here uh, all are all, all different from each other. So that is, you know, proof that these are all separate payments. So, this is the um, May 4th uh, payment for Brendan. So, we'll go to the May 4th, uh, May 4th payment for Stephen right here. Okay, completely different receipt number, as I said. Okay, so this one's for Stephen Avery, right? $300. There is a handling charge that, that has to get paid each, each payment. So, that has been calculated in from the donation amount so this is all stuff that gets calculated in uh, but that's why we wanted to show everybody this so that everybody can understand it completely so these that's that's Stephen for May 4th so that's both of them got uh, the first $300 installment on May 4th then because of the rule I was showing you here they had to wait until May 12th to do another so here's Brendan's May 12th And there you see $300, uh, very, uh, completely different 
the receipt number, no question there. And so this is the May 12th, uh, you know, payment for Brendan. Now we'll look at the May 12th payment for Stephen. And here is Stephen for May 12th. Here we go. Completely different receipt number, $300 handling charge. All right. So there we go. That is May 12th. Now we'll move to May 20, May 21st for Brendan. Okay. So here we are, Brendan Dassey. Completely different receipt number, $300. All the same stuff, but here we go. So this would be the May 21st. Okay, so it's gone from May, May 4th to May 12th to now May 21st. Now we'll go over and see Steven's payment for May 21st. Here it is. Payments for Stephen Avery on May 21st. Completely unique receipt number. There we go. So that's what we got there. So that is now bringing, that brings it up to May 21st. So the next date is May 30th. So here's Brendan's May 30th here, right? So, okay, Brendan Dassey, unique receipt number. And like I said, another $300 payment for Brendan on May 30th. So that is at that point a total of $1,200 that's been put on Brendan's books as of May 30th. So now we'll go check on Steve's May 30th payment. All right, here's this payment for Steven on, into his canteen on the 30th, $300. So that makes $1,200 now uh, that has been deposited in Steven's account. That brings us now to June. So Brendan's, Brendan, June 9, right? Here. Okay. Completely unique at receipt number $300 that brings it up to $1,500 that's been deposited into Brendan's account so $1,500 to Brendan on uh, June 9th now we'll check on Stevens June 9th oh June 8th for Steven sorry here it is and Stephen Avery a completely unique receipt number $300 so that makes $1,500 that has been deposited onto Stevens Canteen as of June 8th for Steven. So, so basically June 8th and 9th, Steven and Brendan both have been, have had $1,500 placed on their books or their canteen. Uh, and we have a few more receipts to go through here. So here, let's move on to Brendan's June 18th receipt. So, here is the uh, receipt. Obviously, Brendan Dassey, uh, 516985 receipt ID, basically, right? Like that's in, And all these receipts have that same ID. And here's the receipt number, completely unique number, $300. That makes $1,800 as of June 18th that has been placed on Brendan's books. Now we'll go over to look at Stephen on June 17th here. Same thing, $300, completely unique receipt number, all that sort of stuff. So $300 going on to Stephen Avery's books on his canteen. So that makes, that makes $1,800 now on Stephen's and Brendan's books as of June 17th and 18th. So $1,800 is our account at the moment. And we got, I believe, one more receipt for each of them here. Yes, June 26th and June 25th. For the for them, so here's June 26th for Brendan, $300 that takes up to $2,100 that has been placed on Brendan's books as of right now. So that means almost all of it because it was about a $2,400. I think it was about 20, I think it was $2,400 and and some change basically uh, that 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 were that was that was left over after paying for you know, the GoFundMe, um, you know, fees and all the stuff on all the donation fees that we, that had to be paid. Um, the, it came out to where I believe it was about 2,400 would change. So we're almost there. I mean, we're a bit literally about, you know, that $300 away from it. So we're, that's, 
that's where everybody can rest assured the the money has gotten to Stephen and Brendan, uh, and and I can't be happier that it has. It's good. It's good to know that it has, and uh, so anybody out there that even had any kind of uh, question about it, you now know. The payments have been made on the time schedule that was afforded or which was pointed out in the email I showed you at the beginning and we are now almost there Stephen and Brendan have almost completely received almost all that money um, that was donated and there's just I think maybe one maybe a, maybe two payments left for both maybe just because there'll be an extra hundred bucks or something that that needs to get deposited uh, or something like that but but we're basically down to the last one or two payments and and Stephen and Brendan have already received a great deal of it of the money that's been donated there's just a little bit more to go and when that happens I'll come back and show you guys those final couple payments so you can see that as well all right, all right. and then here is the deposit made for Stephen on June 25th so Stephen Avery June 25th completely unique receipt number $300 bringing the total to $2,100 that has been put on Stephen's canteen uh, so both both boys at this point in time have had $2,100 placed on their canteens uh, so everybody can know that that that, that money's going where it's supposed to go and uh, you know not that anybody was questioning but just so anybody that did have a question can be reassured in the fact that the money is going where it's supposed to so that's about it for uh, the receipts right, here so there we have it just for anybody's peace of mind uh, if they were wondering how that was going you know or how long you know because you saw the other video and knew that there was that waiting period and you were just wondering how long how it was going well now you know so it's all it is just a transparency video to show that that money is clearly and obviously getting to where it's supposed to go and uh, we obviously want everybody to know that um, because you know it was such a great experience wouldn't want to taint it in any way so there you go folks uh hope you enjoyed it and we'll obviously see you later if you haven't already please hit subscribe